Welcome to Tuesday's CFT on the go. We have a great push-pull strength session coming up here. We have four sets on a 12-minute clock. You'll have 12 dumbbell chest flies with a two-second pause at the top. She's going to lay on her back with her feet pulled in, and then she's going to come out keeping under tension in that pause and pulling back in, making sure you're engaging your lats, your core, and not letting your arms just flop out to the side. You should be under tension for all 12 reps. Then we have 12 dumbbell upright rows. She's going to stand. As she pulls these up, she has a two-second pause at the top and lets them come down. She's not arching her back. She's keeping a nice tight core. She does this and she's driving with her legs to keep the dumbbells in place. Now for your push-pull workout, we have an AMRAP of 12 minutes. 24 dumbbell hang snatches and they're alternating here. So from here, she's in the hang position. Knees are slightly bent. She's going to scarecrow punch, bringing that dumbbell up, transitioning anywhere in her chest section for that dumbbell, making sure that she's keeping a nice fluid motion. Then she goes into 24 alternating jumping lunges. From here, she's going to drive up, keeping her chest up the whole time. If she can, she's going to drive down into it. She doesn't have to slam her knee into the ground. If it's not safe for you to go all the way to the ground, you're gonna go where you can safely keep that shin vertical the whole time in front. Then we have 24 sit-ups for an ending. You can be in a butterfly or traditional. She's in a butterfly, or this is traditional, or now it's butterfly. <laughs> she sits up with her hands to her, to her toes, making sure that her shoulders cross her hip plane. And if she does a butterfly, which drives more into her core, she's going to then touch her toes, also breaking her hip plane with her shoulders. Excellent. You guys have fun and hit the mobility after.